Hi you guys, welcome back to another vlog. It's Maggie, if you're new to my YouTube channel, I feel like I haven't vlogged in so long and I'm excited to do a little vlog for you guys. I'm currently, I just got done filming. I've had a lot of campaigns that I needed to film today, so I just got done doing that and I'm about to head out actually and go get my nails done. I'll show you guys in a second, but they're so long. I can't even believe how long they are and overgrown. Like, look at that. I've had them on for a month and my nails underneath, like my natural nails are literally at the edge of the tip. I have gel on right now. So I'm going to go get these taken off. And I think I want to do like a hard gel today. I really want to... Hold on, I'm going to put this sweatshirt on one second. Sorry about that. I'm like, have to head out the door in a second and just have to finish getting dressed oh yeah so i think i'm gonna get a hard gel on my nails today because my natural nails are so long that i was like i might as well do it i'm like really terrified that they're gonna break but hopefully they don't i'm just putting on some aquaphor on my lips also this concealer that i have on right now i'm wearing the say concealer with like a tiny bit of blush from nude sticks also my hair is getting caught in my earring and it's so good like you literally don't need anything else on your face and it just feels like skin it's so lightweight but it's also like very buildable so you can wear it at nighttime with like your full glam look that's what i've been doing and i absolutely love it before we leave i really want to show you this one dress that i just tried on for my video i did a collaboration with j crew for their spring collection and i got to pick out a bunch of pieces for like a spring summer vacation and i am so excited about this one dress like i need to show it to you guys in case you don't have tiktok and you're not going to see also how 2019 is this outfit of me like i've been into wearing my sweat sets with my hoops again and i feel like myself <sighs> i feel like myself again so Gold hoops literally can just like spice up any anything that you wear. But okay, we really gotta go. This is the dress before we leave. It is right here. Oh my god. Okay, so it's this like crochet white dress, and look at the bottom. It's so stunning and it fits so well. And if you have like anything coming up, spring or summer, highly recommend that dress is so pretty. And I love it. I love the fit of it. So, yeah, I just had to share. Okay, I'm going to stop vlogging because they got to get my stuff all together. And, oh, I'm dropping everything because I literally don't have any hands. I feel like my house is a mess. I have so much stuff everywhere, you guys. Like, can I not? I have stuff legit everywhere. I have clothes everywhere, boxes everywhere. And, of course, I'm like running up the door right now okay love you guys i'm back from the nail salon it's such a gloomy day out today but these are my nails i honestly kind of wish i just got french like i did before also i got like these are my natural nails which is so crazy like look how long they are i feel like my natural nails haven't been this long like ever like it looks like i have extensions but yeah i don't remember the color i think it's called Baby Take a Vow by OPI. But anyway, I'm just getting some laundry done right now because I leave for New York tomorrow and I need to like make sure all my stuff is done because I don't want to get home and have like a bunch of stuff to do since I get home on Saturday. But yeah, I just washed my Aritzia stuff and I have been wearing the Aritzia TNA like sweatshirts for years. And I feel like I didn't know this until recently. In order to like prolong the life of them and make them so they don't get like, you know how they're soft on the inside? I feel like before I would wash them and dry them and they would get like pilly and like not soft anymore. And I've been hanging them to dry, which has been such a game changer for me because I feel like in the past, I they would just get like ruined. I don't know. So it was really annoying. Also, I'm gonna move you guys right here. But yeah, it was really annoying. So I've been hanging them to dry. Also, I hang all of my workout stuff as well. And just like other, like this sweatsuit right here. Oh my God, that keeps scaring me. There's like 
the construction going on is crazy and also I can like smell the concrete I don't know they're like pouring concrete I can literally smell it I was like why does that smell but anyway obviously I hang all of my workout stuff as well because it's such like a delicate fabric that I feel like it just makes it last so much longer and sometimes I don't know it, it can be like I get lazy and I'm like I just want to throw it in the dryer and make it like I don't want to have to hang all of it up but it really just makes such a difference when you just take the time it makes your stuff last so much longer I'm really excited to go to New York because I'm going with the brand Amanda Uprichard and we're going to the Olivia Rodrigo concert and I'm so excited I love Olivia Rodrigo <laughs> and I can't wait to go see her and it's gonna be a lot of fun so really excited about that we're only going for two nights so I only have to pack an outfit for tomorrow night because I'm getting dinner with my friends that live there and then I need to pack my outfit for the concert which all of us are being dressed by Amanda Aperture I just have to like style the dress that they sent me and then I need an outfit for Friday day which I don't know what I'm gonna do yet my manager is trying to set up like a meeting with a company while I'm there and she said she would get back to me about that soon so I'm still waiting to hear back about that but yeah I also want to maybe try to get to one of the workouts in New York also because I feel like all the stuff that they have there is just like so much better than Boston, like the Pilates and stuff. <sighs> okay, let's go put all this laundry away. I just spent so much time cleaning my closet. I'm currently trying on outfits for New York, which I wanna show you guys. I'm trying on my outfit for the concert right now. I'm wearing my Amanda Aperture dress, which is so cute. It's like a little romper dress and I'm just trying to style it right now. But I did clean my whole entire closet, which I want to show you guys because I'm actually, I feel like I'm constantly organizing it. But I finally, like, organized all my boots. I used to have, like, a ton of boxes up here, which, like, took up a ton of space for me to be organizing all of my boots at the top. So I took all the boxes down and I just put them underneath, like, this thing over here. Because I don't want to get rid of them, but I don't know. I just need to find a space where it's like not taking up space in my closet. So I have all of my pants right here, like my white pants and my black gray, obviously in skirts. And then I moved my shirts right here because I felt like my shirts used to be right here and I felt like I couldn't see them. And then they were also right here. Like this is just weird over here to reach because like my jackets are in the way. So I wanted to put stuff that like I'm not reaching for every single day. So I have my sweaters right here and then right here is all of my sweatshirts and my little workout tops and stuff like that. And then I have extra hangers back there, which I used to have right here, which were just taking up this whole entire bar. And I put my jeans there. I need to still figure out what to do with all these <laughs> shoes that I have. I need to get like a shoe rack or something. And then we have more boots at the top. And right here, I have all of my, like, t-shirts, tank tops, more shoes down here at the bottom. And then I had a bunch of boxes here, but I freed up space. So we have all of my ballet flats and a pair of loafers, sandals. We have dresses and coats right here. And then more shoes up there at the top. And then over here, I have my coat and purse closet. So right here, I just have a lot of my leather jackets and then a bunch of my blazers, fur, and stuff like that right here. Some more belts. I really need to do like belt organization because I have so many belts and I feel like I just don't have like a good place for them right now. I kind of want to get hooks and put them like on the back of this door, like the little stick on one so I can like see all of my belts. And I have all of my bags on this side. I just have like all my by far bags right here. Bunch of purses, Bottega bags down here. And then just like other random ones down there. But anyway, so that is what we're working with right now with the organization. And this is my outfit, which 
I really don't know. Yeah, I think that this is like the final look. I just have two jackets that I'm deciding between. So I'm wearing these boots. They're like these moto boots from Steve Madden. They are the Mew Mew boot dupe. They're really cute. And I felt like it was very like Olivia Rodrigo. And so this is the first jacket that I tried on. It's Free People. This one's an oversized leather brown. And I was thinking to do, I definitely want to do a leather because I feel like it just kind of goes with the vibe of the boots. But this is the dress right here. It has little shorts underneath, which I feel like I really like because I don't know, you don't have to worry about it like flying up or anything. I'm wearing a size small and then just has buttons, it's halter and open back. I really wanna wear this jacket, I think, from Lamarck. I love Lamarck, they have the best leather pieces. And I just think I like the fit of this one a little bit more. So we have, yeah, cause it doesn't cover like the skirt as much, but I think I like this one. What do you guys think? I wish that you guys could comment this like in real time and let me know if you like this one better or the free people one. Okay, outfit number two. I always have to try on my outfits fully when I travel because I feel like if I put something together in my head, like I just have this outfit on with a little mini skirt and these boots are like super tall, the ones I'm wearing. And I was like, oh, this looks so cute. And then I'm like walking around and I'm like, wait, no, I actually like, I, like I hate this. So I put on these low rise, boot cut jeans from Redone and my belt is from by far. It's like a, it almost is like a brown, but it's kind of like between brown and red. And I'm just wearing a white tank. My jacket is from Penny Lane and I love it. My bag is a vintage Gucci bag that I got off of the Real Real. And then my boots are from the Attico. They're like these really tall, brown snake skin boots so this is the fit oh and these earrings that i'm wearing oh, i keep getting fuzzes from my jacket in my mouth but the earrings that i have on are from etsy they're just like little vintage earrings and they were like 12 bucks or something they were super cheap and i just think that they're so cute but yeah this is the fit i kind of wish i don't know i like the white tank the only other color I have is black, but I don't know. I think that this is cute. Oh my God, it's literally thundering out right now and it's kind of freaking me out. But okay, we have one last outfit, which I just want to pack like, I don't know. I feel like you always need like a casual safe outfit, nothing crazy. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys kind of what I would do if it was like a day to night outfit. So... This is what we're working with. We have this blazer from the Frankie shop. This is the boyfriend oversized blazer. And then I just have on a little t-shirt from, it's like the Reed on Haynes t-shirt. And I just did, this is what I do to like tuck my shirts into my bras. I literally take the two sides and I just tuck one tuck right here, one tuck right there. And you have like the perfect crop. And then blazer, these jeans are the Levi's dad jeans. And then I just threw on these really fun heels, which are from Saint Laurent and they're leopard. They're like a mule. And I love these. And I feel like it just like adds, hopefully you guys can see me, a little something. And then I'm also gonna bring these hoops right here. These Jennifer Fisher, like really thick hammered hoops. And that is, another outfit also you could totally do like make this a day outfit and add a loafer like i would just do like a little slip on loafer or you could do like a pair of ballet flats or even sneakers and then a fun pair of sunglasses good morning i just got out of the shower i did a body shower this morning i think i'm gonna oh i still need to brush my hair but i want to slick my hair back tonight hold on you want to come in so I don't wash my hair, I'm just gonna put it up. But anyway, I did a little self tan last night, which didn't come out too bad. 
I'm gonna bring it with me so I can like touch up tonight. But I did the Lux Unfiltered Hydrating Self Tanning Cream, number 32 in the Rose Scent. And I used this body brush to like blend it, which like came out pretty good. Also, it definitely got messed up right there on my wrist. I'm gonna add like a tiny bit more because I don't want it to look too crazy. But yeah, I went to bed so late and I feel like, I don't know, I feel really good right now for only getting like five hours of sleep, which I'm so funny. Like <laughs> I feel like I'm the type of person where I literally need, like I'm not even kidding you guys, like nine hours to be like a functioning human. So I feel really good right now. You know, when you just have like that adrenaline from like the night before you travel. I had a dream two nights ago and I literally, in my dream, it was me and graded on the train and I forgot, I got all the way to New York and forgot my makeup bag. And I'm like, oh my God. So I woke up and I was like freaking out because in my dream I was like really stressed out. I'm like, what am I gonna do? Well, at least I'm in New York, like I can go buy all new makeup. But then I was just like, I don't know, <laughs> it was so stressful. So I need to like make sure to pack, triple check everything and yeah, I just thought that it was so funny because I also washed all my makeup brushes yesterday. So they're all clean. That's probably why I thought that I was gonna forget it. I've been using this new moisturizer and I really like it. It's a Glymed Oxygen Cream. And it's like, I don't know. It's a lot lighter than the one I was using before. My esthetician recommended it. Oh, it like smells really good, like oranges. And she recommended this one to me for spring and summer because it's like a lot lighter than the Jen Marini one that I was using. Oh, and I love it. I'm also an eye cream girl. This is the Free Skin by Tessa Eye Cream. I feel like I've noticed such a difference when I've been using eye cream. Like my concealer goes on so much smoother. Oh, also I think that the Sephora sale I'm gonna look when I'm on the train, but I think the Sephora sale starts this week. So I'm gonna make like a little favorites list and I'm gonna put it down below in the description because there are some products that I've been using, like makeup products that I really have liked. And like, obviously you don't have to buy any of the stuff that I talk about, but if you're in the market for new products, definitely check out the list. If you have ran out of something and you want to like restock or try out something new, definitely check out my list because I feel like I've been using some really good stuff right now. Okay, I'm gonna pack my toiletry bag. This is by Baze. It's the cosmetic case and I have these cute little necessaire, like travel size. Am I okay? Like, I'm so clumsy right now. I have the shampoo and the conditioner, which are almost out. I should order a new one from the sale. And then we have a little body lotion. I already ran out of the body wash, but like, look how cute this little mini body lotion is. And then I just have all of my other face washes in these travel containers, which I need to refill because I know that one of them is running really low. And a little mini flamingo shaving cream. This is what I'm bringing for brushes. We have, I use this hourglass brush, the fluffy side for my foundation. And then you can obviously use this for like powder. And then we have the bronzer brush. This is the Patrick Ta. I really love it. It's the contour number two. And then we have my concealer, which is 
the say brush it's the double sided i use that for concealer i love using this side for blush i've been really liking that lately and then we have a little hourglass brush for powder and sometimes i use this side for blush also and just a little eyeshadow brush and i think that that's all that i need these are all my clean brush i literally have so many makeup brushes but these are all my clean ones in here okay i'm gonna add these ones i just cleaned back into here okay and then for makeup i don't really switch out my makeup especially right now i feel like i'm in like such a routine and i really like the products that i've been using but i am gonna bring this lip liner the makeup forever wherever walnut and then just the charlotte tilbury pillow talk i feel like i bring those two everywhere i go and then i've been loving this lip right now the you beauty in the shade lady and then i just have all of my makeup in my louis vuitton case we have my eyeshadow i just got this new eyeshadow palette from ysl beauty so i'm excited to try that eyelash curler blush i've been using nude sticks right now highlighter primer stuff like that i feel like i always panic though before i leave i'm like do i need to add like one more product like what if i what if i need it when i'm gone half the time i don't but i just get scared i might do a say lip oil for fun and then i think i'm gonna add this pat mcgrath lip gloss And everything fits all nicely. I travel outfit of the day. I'm literally wearing all black. My trench is from the Frankie shop. I'm wearing a Skims black long sleeve underneath. And then my Lululemon Align mini flares with my Adidas Sambas. And that is the fit. I'm gonna head out. Oh, also I'm wearing a black MEJ clip. I'm literally wearing all black. I should have wore a different shirt, but honestly, whatever. Anyway, I'm gonna end off this vlog here. I hope that you guys enjoyed it and stay tuned for my next vlog, which is gonna be a New York vlog. And I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye.